Hey everybody, Super Ajax One here after a very long, long hiatus, and it's time for my next Let's Play. Is it Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Gate to Infinity? I say to you, nope. Fire Emblem Sacred Stones. I am giving this another shot and putting password protection on all my files. Anyway, I would like to get a few things cleared through my game. Well, first of all, Fire Emblem, it's uh, very not as well known as any of the four main Nintendo franchises, but it is a Nintendo game. And so I really love it, and um, if you want to get it on your 3DS, you can get it on the Ambassador program for free, which is a program basically which means if you got it before they raised the price significant, I mean lowered the price significantly, you can get a bunch of free games. But you can also buy it at the eShop. Did you see that person right there with the green hair? You recognize her, don't you? So I'm actually going through the intro of this game, and like right in here, like I have completed the game multiple times. And the game kind of splits off into two different sections at one point. So I will be pausing, so like, you know, I will have to split it into like more episodes than necessary and I'm gonna have to use two files. So I will be keeping up and I will be going on the normal difficulty which means no play hints will be provided. So as you can see, I cleared all my data. So let's go to the prologue, The Fall of Rennes. In an age long past, evil flooded over the land. Creatures awash in dark tide ran wild, pushing mankind to the brink of annihilation. In its despair, mankind appealed to the heavens, and from a blinding light came hope. The Sacred Stones. These five glorious treasures held the power to dispel evil. The hero Grado and his warriors used the sacred stones to combat evil's darkness. They defeated the demon king and sealed his soul away within the stones. With the darkness imprisoned, peace returned to Magville. But this peace would not last. The Continent of Magvel. For some 800 years, a quiet peace reigned in the absence of the terrible darkness. The sacred stones have been passed down from generation to generation. Nations have been built around their power and their legacy. The Kingdom of Rennes, ruled by Fado, the peerless warrior king. The Kingdom of Frelia, ruled by Hayden, the venerable sage king. The Kingdom of Johanna, ruled by Izmer, queen of white dunes. The Theocracy of Rostin, ruled by Mansell, the Divine Emperor. The Grado Empire, ruled by Vigarde, the stalwart Silent Emperor. These five countries house the powers of the Sacred Stones. They are joined by the emerging mercantile Republic of Carcino. In these times of peace, Tales of past conflict, ha conflict have drifted into legend, and memories of the ancient dark arts have all but evaporated. It is now the year, year 803. In an instant, the whole of Magvel is threatened by an unexpected atrocity. The Grado Empire, the largest of the Sacred Stones nations, has invaded the Kingdom of Rennes under orders from Emperor Vigarde. A longtime ally of Grado, Rhinus is caught off guard, un unable to mount any resistance. Grado's forces move quickly, seizing one territory after another. Com compounding King Fado's worries, his son, Prince Ephraim, has gone missing. Grado's momentum carries its armies to the gates of the castle. Rennes will fall. It is, 
it is inevitable. The prologue, the fall of Redis. So it appears Grado has had a change of heart. Mm -hmm. Your Majesty, I bear bad news. The castle gate has been breached. Emperor Vigarde's forces are within the castle walls. I understand. The garrison has fallen. We've lost contact with Prince Ephraim and expect no and can expect no aid from his men. Your Majesty, what are we to do? What else can we do? Order your men to lay down their arms. Father, Erica, are you wearing the bracelet I gave you? Yes, I have it right here. Good. Seth. Yes, Your Majesty? Take Erica and head for Frelia. King Hayden is an honorable man. I trust he'll keep you safe. Understood. And what of Your Majesty? Me? I shall remain here. We have long held Grado among our dearest alleys. Yet now they attack? I must know why. Am I somehow responsible for this? Have I erred in my leadership? Rennes is mine to guide. How could I have failed her so? Father, you can't stay. You mustn't. If you remain behind, then so shall I. Go now, Seth. Ride. Take her to safety. Father! Forgive me, Your Highness. And the forces have closed in. Rennes. Ephraim. Erica. You must survive. General Seth! Friends, ride ahead and bring word of our coming to Frelia. A single rider has better odds of passing unseen by Grado's men. Convey to the throne all that has happened here and petition for reinforcements. Uh, understood. Princess Erica, we must... Quickly, behind me! You there with the girl. Tell me, would that be the wayward princess of Rennes? Well, this must be my lucky day. You're a dead man. The wench goes with me. Never! I am Walter, the Moonstone, Grado's finest general. And you're just a corpse who does not know he is dead. Mm -hmm. So Seth goes in, but he misses. And Walter wounds him. Bad. Ah, uh, no! Such terrible wounds, and still he holds to his duty? How entertaining. Fly away, little man, fly away. Try to outrun death. More time to save the hunt and the kill. Princess Erica, this way. I can see no more of Grado's men. If we've made it this far, surely we've earned, we've earned a moment's rest. Please forgive me grabbing you so brusquely earlier. Don't be foolish, Seth. If it weren't for you, I would have never made it out of the castle. You are the reason I'm still alive. You have my eternal gratitude. And whoever that man was, he was clearly after me. It's my fault you received such a grave wound. Allow me to treat it, I... Your Highness, I cannot allow an injury like this to be an obstacle. We have more important battles to attend to. We must press on to Frelia. We must fulfill His Majesty's wishes. I wonder how my father fares alone in the castle. Do you think he's safe? And what of my brother on the Grado front? We've heard nothing from him for days. King Fado and Prince Ephraim are both valiant and brave men. I doubt even the might of Grado Empire can hold them in check. More important to me, Your Highness, is that you look to your own safety. How sad the two of them would be if something were to happen to you. We must reach Fralia to ensure the day of your happy reunion. Yes, of course, you're right. Until I'm reunited with my father and brother, I must not despair. Come, Seth, let us go. Once we cross that bridge, we'll be in Frelia, near border Mulan. Let us proceed, Princess Erica. We will be proceeding to Frelia in the next episode. So next time on Fire Emblem Sacred Stones, we will be doing just that. See you guys 